enemy brings fear into our lives to paralyze us, to strangle our ability to think, to dream, and to imagine. COVID-19, many people are losing control. They're running scared and becoming very confused. As a result, many are unable to think clearly or act responsibly. They've been overcome with worry, doubt, and fear. Could it be, my brothers and sisters, that while we are facing this global pandemic, that more people are being affected by the virus of fear than they are the virus of Corona. The enemy brings fear into our lives to paralyze us, to strangle our ability to think, to dream, and to imagine does not want to see us going forward. While we ought to be responsibly concerned, we ought not to allow fear to take ownership of our emotions, our choices, or our decisions. God is too big for that. Besides, it does us no good to live out our days in fear. And I remind you that God still rules in the affairs of man. And God is not operating with question marks, with uncertainties, or in confusion. He operates in confidence, in certainty, and with stability. Stability.